playbook. And I only know them by the EMG, but I think they were beginning geography, continents and ocean, landforms, and bodies in water, and do you remember what the third one was? I think, I think that the landforms was one in the bodies Bodies of water, and then yeah. continents. Yeah. Okay, so we made them all into one book, and actually added one thing at the end, which I absolutely love, and it's around the world with animals. So it actually has the continent, and then the animals that are found in that continent, and the first group was the smartest group because they told me that Arctic means bear and Antarctic means no bear. So you will not find polar bears in the Antarctic. So, something that you can have. Well, I've got a way for you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm using it with every group. I didn't know that. Really smart. So this is actually based on national geography standards. Somebody from the last group asked me well, what are those standards. And um, actually, in the book, because we're Evan Moore, we actually tell you. So this lesson <laughs> on Nashville, it actually tells you that it's based on the following National Geography Standards. So we really take the guesswork out of everything for the teachers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So if you have any teachers that are looking for um, geography lessons for primary students and they need something really, really easy, this is your go-to book. Um, because it provides the geography instruction and practice. There's simple lessons that are easy to teach. Um, there are activity pages and uh, varying levels of difficulty. So that supports differentiated instruction. Um, it supports um, teachers with three scaffolded cumulative review pages. So anything with that differentiated differentiated instruction, um, you know, teachers kind of flock to. So beginning geography. Thank you.